you guys welcome back to my channel um this week i wanted to do a what i got for christmas haul um before i get started i just wanted to say i'm very thankful for everything i got and yeah so let's get started so the first thing i'm gonna go through is my stocking it looked better than this on christmas but i can't ever put anything back in it so yeah i have a candy cane full of miniature reese's I got hand masks and foot masks. I got some face masks. This one is a exfoliating strawberry peel off mask. This one is a pure minimizing T zone and full facial mud mask. If it will focus. Um, this one is a hydrating sheet mask with watermelon for its bees. Next thing I got in my stocking was some the tea dry shampoo. It is my favorite dry shampoo. It has it's like for dark hair, so it doesn't make my hair white, which I really enjoy. And it actually works and most dry shampoos don't work for me. So I never liked dry shampoo, but that one is by far my favorite. I got Ferrero Rocher's. I got a big thing of them. Is that focused? There it is. Um, I got pens. I'm pretty sure one of these is red and one of them is pink, but I am colorblind, so I am not sure because they both look pink to me. I got some mints because these are my favorite mints. Um, I got a Starbucks gift card because I might be addicted to Starbucks. Oh, I got this little surprise Lego man. He, he came in like a bag and you had to build it and you didn't know which one you got. I got the reindeer. He's pretty cute, if I do say so. Don't focus on the bookshelf. He's pretty cute, if I do say so myself. He also comes with a little with a little present, and he holds it. I think that's all that's in the front pocket. Oh, this is the present. It's a little box, and then you put the top of the thing on the, on the box. It's really cute. Next thing I got is Nerd Gummy Clusters. These things are so good and I don't even like candy. I prefer chocolate. I have, I got a bath bomb, a nightclub for you, your tub, disco bomb, a fruit punch bath fizzer with a light up, with a light up surprise inside. Apparently that has... There's a light up surprise. Now I need to take a bath before I go back to school. I got these tissues. Um, look how cute they are. They have a. That's not in focus. They have a. Is it? They have a mouse on them, and they're really cute. I love mice. I got this thing. Which is like a a little yellow guy that you put slime in its mouth and you squeeze it and it comes out. We all got one and so I played with my moms and my cousins and it's, it's really fun. <laughs> the next thing I got was this. It's a shark and it's a bath toy. So I don't remember what you do. Oh, you pull this and it swims in your bathtub um I'm a child and I'm going to use that with my bath bomb oh this is the minifigure bag that my thing came in my my little reindeer I got 
some socks that have dinos giving hugs on them. They're so cute. I got two Burt's Bees chapsticks because Burt's Bees is by far my favorite chapstick. The normal one though, because if it doesn't burn, in my opinion, it's not working. And I got a bunch of chocolate. These are Ghirardelli Caramel Chocolates. It's upside down, but you get the gist. That is, I think all that's left in my stocking. Wait a minute. I got socks! I didn't think Max got me socks! I got socks! Look how cute they are! They're so fuzzy. Oh. <laughs> Oh my god, I'm so excited. <laughs> They're all fuzzy. And now the rest in here is just candy, which I will be eating because these are my favorite candy. Oh my god, I didn't know I got socks. That makes me so happy. Now we are moving on to what I got for Christmas underneath the Christmas tree. I got this game from my auntie. It is called Ransom Notes. It is a game where you put like magnets on like a board and you had to make a sentence. It was really fun. We played it on Christmas. That is why it is open. The next thing I got was some tarot cards from my cousin Grace. Um, I also opened these on Christmas and they are stunning. This is called Tarot of the Divine. So these are the cards. This is a little book that comes in it. And these are the cards. They look like this, and they have these pictures on the back. <laughs> this is Five of Swords, so they're really pretty. They're so pretty. So, thank you, Grace. I also got a pair of pants from Hollister from my mom. They are just green corduroy pants, and I absolutely love them the next thing i got was also a puzzle from my sister and you're not ready for this it's a puzzle that lights up and it's a foreign one so you can make a squid a bird and a fish oh i lied this is an octopus and a shark and you build it and then it lights up it lights up that is I can't wait to make it. I can't wait to build it. I'm so excited. I got some Slim Jims. If you know me, you know I'm obsessed with these. I don't know why the back of this box says Long Boy Gang. Because these are the snack size Slim Jims. But I'm going to eat these. This is what I eat at school. Healthy, I know. My ex fiance Max got me gloves and they fit perfectly, which is weird because I have really small hands. I don't know how he did this, but if I can get them on correctly. Like my fingertips, they, they fit perfectly. I don't know how he did that, but these are the first pair of gloves I think I've ever owned, so. That's good. I should probably wear them. I'll probably wear them to farm, which is great. My Nana got me this game. It's called Family Face Off. I have no clue what it is. I've never played it before. So when I play it, I'll update you if it's fun or not. It looks really fun. Um, the back of it says, guess it, face off, find it, act it. So I think it's a game there's four categories, two teams, one absurdly good time. I don't know, but this just seems like it's going to be a lot of fun to play. I also got the Billie Eilish perfume. Why did I just say her last name like that? We'll never know. Um, but it smells delicious. Vanilla is one of my favorite scents, so 
it's just right up my alley. This is what it looks like if you haven't seen it. It is like a body outline of a female. It is gorgeous. It is stunning and I love it and it smells it smells so good. Love it. Next thing I got was from my dad. Um, I got green Vans. Green is my favorite color and I love Vans. I wear them to death. But look how cute they are. They're like suede. I Thank you, Dad. Yeah, if you didn't know, I go to Michigan State. That is the college I go to. And so he got me this really soft, fuzzy, half zip up jacket thing. And I love it. It is very soft and there is pockets. There is pockets in this and it is fantastic. From my dad, I also got Michigan State pajama pants that I have already worn multiple times. They're very cozy and there's just the little Spartan head logo on the back. No, nope, the front, the pocket. And they are very cozy and I and last thing I got from my dad were AirPods, which I'm very thankful for because these are not cheap. And since the beginning of the school year, I have only had one AirPod because I fall asleep with my AirPods in, in my dorm room. And somehow I lost my AirPod in my sleep and I cannot find it anywhere. I've looked everywhere in my room. I've unmade my bed. I've remade it. I took my mattress off my bed, I've looked under my desk, I looked in my garbage can, I looked in the closet, I looked in all my clothes, I could not find it anywhere. So I got new AirPods, which I was not expecting, but I'm very thankful for. From my mom, I got this really cozy blanket that looks like my old blanket that she may or may not have destroyed in the washer on accident because she put something in the washer with it that destroyed it and made it shed and everything stuck to it and it was no longer soft at all. So she basically got me the same blanket, just like the fuzzy part that she ruined. And I love it, it is very cozy. I was not expecting it. I'm gonna be honest, um, I have no clue what is in this box because it is currently January 1st and I wanted to do this after Christmas when I got home, but it did not go as planned. And our closet flooded our apartment on Christmas, no, the day after Christmas, so the 26th. So we have not been home since then. So I'm not quite sure what I'm pulling out of my present box. I'm not gonna lie, I kind of forgot what I got for Christmas. So it's a surprise to me and you. Oh, this is my ring I got from my Nana. Look how cute it is. It's in this little box. I'm actually wearing it right now. Actually, no, I lied. The one that she got me is in here. It is a name ring. It says my first and last name. It says, no, my first and middle name. It says Callie Stefflin, which is my middle name. I have one actually, which is right here on my finger that she got me a long time ago. And I lost it for a good month, maybe. And she bought this as a replacement, even though I found this one. But I think it's really cute, and I have a backup, and I love it. I also got rings from my auntie, which have been put in here. I got a little wave, because I love water. That is one thing about me. I am a fish, and this also goes with it. I love sharks. Sharks are one of my favorite animals. If you didn't know this about me, I actually have a shark tattoo. You can't really see it. He's right there. His name is Chi Chi. And this ring has a shark tooth on it. Look how cute. I love it. Thank you, auntie. And last but not least, this is the last ring I got from my auntie. Is a star ring. I also think it's very pretty. I would be wearing them right now. But I don't really have any room left on my fingers. I also got this ring from my Nana and it's really cute. It, it's a hand that's hugging your finger 
and on the inside it says always with you and it's really cute and i've been wearing that since i opened it on christmas another thing i got from my nana was this christmas tree ornament every year we get an ornament from her it's kind of our like a tradition and this one says my name on a little piece of wood and it has a dinosaur on it which also if you don't know what's about me i love dinosaurs i'm obsessed with them i am a child and on the back it says love nana 2022 and it has a corgi a christmas corgi and it's butt i think it's really cute so i love that you can go on their tree there's usually a tree right here but because of the closet incident um we had to take it down so it's not very christmasy but that's okay the next thing i got was from my sister it is a baking book look at the wrapping it came in it is so pretty it says papier um which is paper in french and it's a sticker and it comes off but i'm just gonna take it off like look how cute it is it's personalized it's custom so it says callie's baking recipes and as of right now there is nothing in it but I'm, the first thing I'm putting in here is Tanya Burr's Christmas cookies? No. Chocolate chunk cookies. Because they're some of my favorite things to make in the planet. And they're delicious. So that would be the first thing going in this book. Also a cool thing about this book is that it has conversions in it. And if you don't know, I live in America, obviously. Actually, that's not very obvious, other than the fact that I sound like an American. But there's conversions, and I like to make a lot of recipes that are from, like, Europe. And I don't know the conversions between, like, milliliters and ounces. So there's there's that. So I always try to Google it, and Google always fails me. It's never correct. I also got another pair of shoes for Christmas from my sister, they are Nike blazers. Um, I have been wanting these for a really long time. I just have the white and black ones, like the original ones. And I love them, and I can't wait to wear them. She also got me some Nike socks that match my new shoes. I also like to wear these with, like, Converse because I have high tops and... Low socks just come off when you wear Converse, so I did put this on my Christmas list. Another thing I got was, I think, from my auntie. These were actually in our stockings. They are index cards, and it's an index card box, and they have the index cards in them. But they're just not normal index cards. It also has the print of the box on the index cards, which is so cute. I love them. I will probably use these for one exam, but then I can just fill it up with other index cards. So, thank you, E.T. The last thing my sister got me, I have been searching for, and I love her. And one day, we walk into Barnes & Noble, and we always look at the pop figures, because we have pop figures in our Barnes & Noble. And on the side is the Strawberry Shortcake pop figure, who is discontinued, so she's no longer made. But my sister found her! Look how cute she is. She does smell like strawberries, and it is heaven. Look at her. This is not focusing. But look at her! She's so cute! She has her little freckles. I don't know, I love her. She does not come with her cat, though, which is fine. I don't care. And she didn't come in a box. But we love her anyway. I love her. Now we are on to the presents my auntie got me. And she got me my Function of Beauty shampoo and conditioner. This is the shampoo I use. It's just the straight hair Function of Beauty shampoo. And the straight hair Function of Beauty conditioner. Which I love. And she got me the things to go in them. So that's just like their normal base shampoo and conditioner. But then they also sell these little boxes that have... Oh, that's the wrong side. The boxes that have like your goals in them, your hair goals. So this one is strengthened. 
You can put up to three in each of your shampoo and your conditioner. Two comes in this. Um, I got deep condition. I also got lengthen. Anti frizz. And volumize. Which I love. So one of them I'm going, well, I'm going to put three in my shampoo and three in my conditioner. But I think because I have five boxes, I'm going to do a double in one of them. So you can put up to three things in one bottle. So I'm going to do volumize, strengthen, and lengthen all in my conditioner. And then in my shampoo, I'm going to put deep condition, anti-frizz, and also lengthen. So I'm looking forward to doing that. It's like a science experiment. And I'm very grateful she got these for me because I'm actually out of shampoo. And the last thing my auntie got me, I am also very grateful for, and I was not expecting, and it's a GoPro. So now I don't have to film my videos on my phone. And I'm very excited to figure out how it works. I did open it, but there's no SIM card in here, so I have to go and buy one. This is what it looks like. It comes in a little GoPro case that has a handle and everything. And then you open it, and it looks like this. So, like, the instructions are obviously in here. When you take all of like the instructions and everything off, you're left with this. This is the actual GoPro. So this is the camera. Um, it's just a little, a little guy and I love him. Um, apparently it's a he. Didn't know that until just now. I also have the case that goes on it and it comes with a little it's stuck in the box but it does come with a little truck pod thing and that's the battery that just fell out of there so i'm gonna put that back in there and it also comes with a light so i should be using this for this video so now i have light but it's a very bright light that gets brighter and brighter and then it's a strobe light, which I'm not going to do because Ronald has epilepsy. And everyone out there that has epilepsy, you cannot look at this. <sighs> and you hold it down and turn it off. But that is what comes with a GoPro. I'm very excited to use it once I get my SIM card to go in it. I'm going to start filming my videos on it. So, yeah. I have one more gift that I got yesterday from my aunt's fiancé. And it is this. It is a paint by numbers and it is Charlie Brown and Starry Night. And it comes with the paints. And this is what it's going to look like when I'm done painting. Last but certainly not least is my present from my Uncle Dean. On Christmas Day, he gave me this card that said... It's the most wonderful time of the year with little Santa on it. And inside it says, look at your phone from my Uncle Dean and Grace. So that is what I did. And on my phone, I got a text. It was a text message of a picture of this. So from that picture, you could tell that I got a guitar. I do already have a guitar. It is pink and I love it. But... My dream guitar has always been a black guitar, so I asked for a black acoustic guitar for Christmas, not expecting to get it, and I did. So, here it is. This is the case it came in. It's just a black case, and this is what she looks like. She is gorgeous, and I'm 
obsessed with her. I officially got her out of the case. And this is her. She is all black. She's an all black fender. And I got a new guitar pick. It's green. It's like marble green. It's very pretty. But yeah, this is my new guitar. And I love her. This is what she sounds like. And on the side it has, has a tuner. So you can turn it. It's a built-in tuner. So that is it for what I got for Christmas. Um, well, like I said in the beginning of the video, I am very thankful for everything I got and everyone I got to spend Christmas with. And I hope you guys had a great Christmas too and got some fun things. But I was not expecting this at all, most of it. Like my GoPro, my guitar, my AirPods, my shoes, um, my little pop figure of Strawberry Shortcake, who is the cutest thing on the planet. Um, and yeah, I'm just very grateful for everything I got. That is it for this video. If you enjoyed it, please give it a thumbs up and comment down below. Also, don't forget to hit the subscribe button and turn on your post notifications. Bye.